have a Stitch Fix haul for you guys. I haven't got one of these in a little while and I had I think only like $25 in credits to use but I wanted to use it so I'm going to show you everything they sent me and I'm going to need your help deciding what I'm going to keep. I'm like in between a couple items right now. So I had Joanna again. I really like her. She's been doing uh, my past couple of Stitch Fixes and I said that like kind of requested that I keep her so so far, so good. I feel like she really understands what I'm going to like. So I will go ahead and just start pulling stuff out. I have a box full. Uh, I guess the first thing we will do is this little air balloon tank top. I think the print is adorable. I love that there's air balloons on it. The only thing I didn't like about it is just like the style in general. I do not enjoy the fabric at the bottom of it. I don't know why, but I just don't. And then I kind of wish the back continued the print. So I will not be keeping this. This is by the brand 860 and it's called the Brixton Balloon Print Tank Top and it retails for $48. So that is also a reason why this is not one of my top runners. The next thing I got was this feather print tank top. I really love this print. It's very full. Like This one is one of the least extensive pieces and it is by Pink Martini called the Ashby Feather Print Pocket Front Tank and it retails for $34. Okay, I am quite disappointed in these pants because I actually really liked them and that's rare to get a pair of pants in that I actually like and fit well. Only problem was it has a seam like that is ripping on it and I don't feel like paying for this due to that fact. I mean I feel like it wouldn't be a huge deal to fix it. I don't know how to fix it but let me, f oh here it is like there's a big hole right there just where the seam is opening up. So I don't know if someone put it on to where they weren't fitting right but I felt like these fit me pretty well and I really liked it. These were by Liverpool and they are called the Vinnie Ankle Length Colored Skinny Jean and they retail for $78. So very expensive but I was going to use it as my one item and put the 25 credit towards it which would have brought the price down. But hopefully I can find it less expensive online. And then I had this one is one of the ones I was debating on between this and then the feather tank. I love the print on this. I love the colors of it. It just was a little tight in my hip area and I feel like because of that I probably wouldn't reach for it in my closet so that's why I'm kind of leaning towards the feather tank. I know everyone's like I want to lose weight. I really do want to lose weight. I just don't know if I would lose any right in that area because that's like the one area that stays pretty consistent. This is by the brand Collective Concepts and it's called the Denova Mixed Material Floral Print Blouse and it retails for $44. And I also was not a fan of the sleeves. They're a different fabric and they kind of feel cheap. Like a satiny polyester. I don't know. I've, I don't know. That's a weird thing to not like but I'm not sure if I like them or not. They're comfy though. And then the very last thing are a pair of earrings. I don't think I even considered these. They're just a little bigger than what I normally wear. Like I'm really into chunky necklaces but not so much chunky earrings. I don't know they're just big. Probably a little heavier than I would want also. These are by the brand Town and Reese and they are called the Winchester Cutout Teardrop Earrings and they retail for $28. So a little too expensive for earrings in my opinion at least. That's everything I got. Let me know what you think between the floral shirt or the feather tank. I feel like I'm leaning a little bit towards the flower tank, be flower, feather tank because one, it was a little less expensive and two, it just fit overall better. So that was everything. I will just see you guys really soon in another video. Bye!